Hello everyone, welcome back to my Nerdy Corner. I'm Cookin, and today I'm going to do a review of the Car Captain Sakura DVD by Madman. I have all the collections, so I have season one, season two, the first movie. And the second movie. This were all released by Madman. This is an Australian release. And I, no, I do not have the Blu-ray, you know, the one day release in America. So um, I'm doing a car capture weekend video, so I'm gonna release three videos. So this one will be about the DVDs. The second video tomorrow on Saturday will be uh, the DVD menus and some screenshots, just a random uh, you know, selection of screenshots to see the quality of these DVD box sets and on Sunday I'll keep it as a surprise but it is an unboxing and you'll see what it will be when I release it and you know, I'm still expecting something else in the post or in both Car Capture Sakura so when that comes but, uh, I'll do an unboxing of that but it's pretty awesome because with the recent announcement of the Car Captor Clear Arc OVA uh, I thought, oh, this is just the perfect time, and I can't wait. Car Captor Sakura is one of my favorite animes. I grew up with it, but I grew up as Car Captors, the the original English dub, and um, you know, with the names like Madison Taylor. I'm like, ooh, ooh. No, I prefer to watch it with the English. I mean, the Japanese dub. But these does not come with the English dub. That came with the Blu-ray, the Animax uh, dub, I believe. There's only Japanese and English subtitles. So without further ado, guys, I'm gonna show off each individual DVD. Then tomorrow, like I said, I'll post uh, every DVD menu that this box set has, and plus some screenshots or an episode of each this. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, first of all, let's see the collection one, the, uh, the club book version. So this is the first arc of the season, you know, the, all the clo cards are collected. Personally, my favorite part. And there's the description. Some special features are textless opening and closing, not very exciting. This is still 4x3. The, the quality is amazing, uh, by the way. The stereo is Japanese 2.0. There's not come with the English dub, like I said before. English subtitles, Japanese origin. This comes with 5 discs, so 875 minutes. And this is Region 4, so because this came out in Australia. So let's see the first. Uh, it has a nice quality image. This comes with the original Japanese uncut version. And. Oops, sorry about that. That was my neighbors. And it has a beautiful logo. It's G rated. And here's the spine. And the back. So this comes with five discs. So. Uh, there you go, uh, one, two, three, four, five. Each picture looks different, just a different color. It's just the same picture but in different color, I mean. And it has a nice inverted sleeve with this nice quality images. So the costume she wears on the final judgment or her dream. And the one based on Alice in Wonderland when she gets all small. So you can invert it if you want, but I just keep it normally. So, because it looks better with the thing. I bought these online on this website called Wi-Fi or hi fi or something like that. Uh, and it was on sale, I had to get it because no way I was going to get the Blu-ray. So let's see part two. Part 2, it covers the Sakura arc, you know, when she starts getting Sakura cards. Has this awesome, beautiful image of Sakura with her fly card activated. This is PG. Um, here's the logo. Let's see a side-by-side -by -side comparison. So there's Clo card and Sakura card. So This also comes with 5 discs. This also comes with something new. This comes with Texas opening closing interview with Sakura Ta. What is it? Tanj? I think that's the voice actress of Sakura. Uh, it's nothing too great. It's okay. Uh, I need to something better. This does, yeah, this does uh, cover the season two and season three. Season two is basically the last few cards 
of the of the cloak card and the rest of Sakura cards. And there you go. This looks pretty much the same as before. Um, five. So it's all 10 discs together. It's nice to have. I wish they had some kind of, what do you call it, like box set. You can just put the, you know, similar to Sailor Moon, you know, you put two parts together. But I'm happy that's how it is. So now let's see the movies. First of all, let's see the first movie. So put this on the side for now. Uh, Car Character Sakura has this beautiful illustration in front of it. This is a sleeve, so this is the first movie. And the first movie is set between season 1 and 2, but she gets the arrow card in this movie. So, the first feature film of the magical TV anime series Car Character Sakura comes with a movie guide booklet, a teaser trailer, uh, if you're theatrical trailer, US trailer and TV commercial. This does have the English dub on it. But this is not it's the original dub, you know, with like Madison Taylor, you know, the, uh, and this is 16 by 9, but this came out in cinema. And it looks amazing. Uh, this is also region 4 and this is region this is PG. And so I'm gonna take out the sleeve. This is how it looks like. This so it's nice, both pictures are different, so, so it has a nice quality picture. It's the picture we've seen so many times before, it's pretty much the same. Same as the back, pulls here if you want to read it, some nice quality pictures. Basically, comes with this little booklet, let's see this booklet first. It just comes with some amazing artwork, has some character descriptions, so some nice quality renders of the battle costumes, some sketches of Kiro Chan, the Tomoyo Nut, Madison Taylor, some other pictures of Mei Lin, Toya, uh, Yukito, the si her sisters, the only time you ever see si the sisters, uh, her, his mother, so it's just beautiful, the arrow card, and some of the cloak cards I've been using in this film. And some interviews and all that, so yeah, pretty much pretty awesome. You didn't get this on the American version, so pretty cool to have. It just stays here. Could be a little bit thicker, but oh well. And here's the disc, it looks pretty much the same as this, and there's nothing on the back really, so it's just some flower petals or stuff like that. So that's the first movie done, and lastly, my favorite movie of the two. I prefer the second movie over the first one because it's so awesome and epic. Car Captor Sakura, the movie. No, Car Captor Sakura, movie, the Silk Card. That's the one. One day, and I remember this when it came out. That's when I start watching Car Captor Sakura again because I bought some bootlegs online and I never watched in the Japanese dubs. That's when I found out about. Um, how edits American anime was. So I never knew there was edits or anything. I didn't even think about it. And when I learned about all of these differences, how the show is completely different, and that's when I, because I watched this movie and I didn't, at first I didn't like the dub because I was so used to the original dub. But this dub, after a while, is amazing. So the English dub they have in here is amazing. So. I think it's the best portray portray portrayal of the characters, you know. I don't like that Animax dub anyway, she sounds so squeaky, but this one is perfect. So, beautiful art in the front. Uh, there's the Nothing card, Sakura and Sharon together. PG as well. There's, here's a side. Let's do a comparison of the two movies. So, it looks pretty much the same. Looks pretty awesome. I'm, I'm glad that it matches, but I'm sad they didn't come with a sleeve of some kind. And this does come with this anime special, Leave It to Kira, which is set after the movie. Because that I always thought it's set before, but now it does make sense when I find out more information. This is 16 by 9, English 5.1, a Japanese 5.1, English subtitles, and Region 4 as well. So this is much cheaper. I'll leave a picture here of the 
original American region one because that one is complete out of stock and really rare. And I'm glad that I got this cheaper version. It also comes with a little like disappointing card. That's it. That's all you get. So the yeah, there's the nothing, and here's the the. That's a mistake. Cause that yeah, it's supposed to say the hope. That's a big mistake. No, 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 no. So here's the actual true form. This comes with some renders of the characters. I love that costume, and I just love this movie. So it's pretty awesome. And also the disc. It looks different. Um, it has the Sakura ring on it, the magic circle. So yeah, guys. So I have something else to show. So I'll be back in a second. Before I bought the Australian DVDs that I have, that I showed you guys, I bought this. This is the Region 1, this is the 10th or the 15th anniversary of the movie. This is so basic and boring, so... Moving on, they still haven't released the second movie, but... Yeah, this has much, like, pretty much the same special features. I just bought that one after the fact, so just... Now, I basically have two copies, same copies, but... The other cover looks a million times better. This is region 1. And yeah, this is kind of a uh, 16 by 9 uh, English and Japanese, English subtitles. So this is unrated for some reason. And this looks pretty much the same. I'll also leave menus and screenshots and maybe do a comparison. It probably looks exactly the same. But this is a recycled cover. So yeah, it feels a bit flimsy. So. So yeah guys, I'll leave you with my final thoughts and don't forget, tomorrow I'll leave off the DVD menus and the screenshots. Also before you ask, I um, might as well show you guys, uh, yes I do have the manga. This is the Onibus' version by Dark Horse. This contains all of the manga in full volume, they are bloody huge. I still haven't read them, I know it's a crime, so I have all four has these beautiful art on the front and and it's as you can see it's huge so has some beautiful artwork I need to read this before reading the clear card arc or watch the anime or whatever and this covers the Sakura arc so it has another beautiful artwork on the front and these are still in perfect condition so I need to read these really badly so well, yeah, now I'll leave you off with my final thoughts. Well, I hope you enjoyed that unboxing. So, uh, any questions about these DVDs, please leave a comment below if you want to know uh, if there's any special features or anything like that, or any general questions. So, leave those below and please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!